Two years ago, voters in St. Anthony approved a temporary budget increase of $125,000 for the South Fremont Fire Protection District. Well, this year, residents there will vote whether they want to make this budget increase permanent. Sasha Zimmerman has more from St. Anthony to tell us more. That's right, and this approval to make the budget increase permanent won't increase property taxes for anyone in the district. This year's elections in St. Anthony will allow voters to choose whether or not they want to make the South Fremont Fire Protection District's temporary budget increase of $125,000 permanent. At the time, we could only do a temporary override. Uh, now, uh, we have to vote to make it permanent. The tax increase has, has been put in place over the last two years. Uh, so the people are already paying the increase in taxes that the, that the levy created. This vote uh, tomorrow will just be to make that override permanent and it will not increase their taxes any further. The fire district says there's some confusion after different websites and articles indicated that making the budget increase permanent would also increase property taxes. You know, the school district is, is also has a levy increase requested at this time that will increase our taxes and the South Fremont Fire Protection District, their levy increase will not. So with the other levy being voted on at the same time for a tax increase, people assume that this would also increase the taxes, which it won't. Another point of confusion is that because the city of St. Anthony was voted into the fire district, some people thought the district would get a huge increase in funding. By law, the district has a budget that's set and cannot increase that budget. So what actually happens is the increase of money from the city makes the district's taxes go down. The money used for the budget increase will go towards payroll benefit purposes for the station employees. I was a former firefighter, as uh, you know, with here, and I know the importance of having someone here to, to, to take care of the needs that we have when we're in the field. The station employees do everything from dispatch to directing firefighters where to go and getting all the equipment ready for when the firefighters arrive. In St. Anthony, Sasha Zimmerman. Back to you in the studio. Sasha, so thank you very much for all your election results. Tune in to KPVI News 6 tomorrow night at 10 o'clock. KPVI.com will update results as we get them into the newsroom. It's going to be a busy day tomorrow.